Hi, my name is Lina Rodriguez Salamanca and today I'm going to give you some tips about hunting for wild edible mushrooms. Wild mushrooms come in all sorts of sizes, shapes, and colors. However, not all wild mushrooms are edible. Some of them can cause you a lot of discomfort if you eat them. Some others may cause death. Oh my God, this is a false morale. Thank oh. you for finding it. It's a gyromitra. Oh, good. Can you false. show me where they were? Yeah, I will. What mm. are they? Awesome! I've never found them. What and are they? Mushrooms are a very difficult thing to ask not to eat. They are sick. Some of them are poisonous? Some of them are poisonous. Identifying a mushroom properly and being familiar with its characteristics, timing of appearance, habitats and look-alike is very important, although not always easy. Never eat any mushroom that has not been properly identified. What we have in here is a Gyromitra burnea. You see they are poisonous. And it's unfortunate that they have on their common name the word morel. Because these guys are not good eats. They have a toxin that is called gyromitrin. And that toxin is really, really bad. You can die from eating these mushrooms. Some people said, well, how about I boil the mushroom? It turns out that that toxin um, will then be moved by the steam and so you'll get poison in different ways too. But you can see the stem here is very thick if you compare it and it has like this flutes in there and it's not hollow they have like those loaves in there. I want to cut this one this look good. Mushroom hunting is a great experience for the kids and the whole family. It's a great way to uh, appreciate nature. There you go. Oh, my mama likes to go for it, Rowan. Oh, you it? There you go. They're always hollow. Whenever you find them, they're hollow. Nice. And they have those pits in there. Hollow and all hollow. Good. When hunting for mushrooms, always respect private property and carry the proper supplies. Bring wax papers to wrap the specimens or paper bags. Do not use plastic as those can promote moisture and lead to decay. Bring a small sharp knife or trowel to cut the mushrooms above the soil level or the substrate. Remove and clean dirt or debris from the mushrooms and you can use a soft brush to clean those. Avoid over mature mushrooms and inspect it for bruises, slime, fuss, or any insects or their activity. Keep collected mushrooms from direct sunlight and hot temperatures and refrigerate soon after harvest. For more information on wild edible mushrooms in Iowa and their poisonous lookalikes, check out the Safe Mushroom Foraging publication at the ISU Extension Store. Mushroom hunting. Plant pathologist out in the woods. Yeah. What are you finding? What do you see? I I found absolutely nothing. It's amazing. But there's trees and thorns. <laughs> I'm finding thorns. That's what most morel so, hunters actually yeah, find. It's amazing. It's, they stick to your clothes and your skin. So <laughs> that's how you can tell it's a thorn. Mm -hmm.